What's up guys, Maximize here from Order League of Legends. Today we're going to be doing a quick review of the newest League of Legends champion, Zeri. Zeri is a non-traditional marksman who has some pretty funky mechanics. So without further ado, let's get into the video. Zeri's passive is Living Battery. Every time Zeri gains a shield, she gets bonus movement speed. And when she attacks the enemy who is shielded, she steals a portion of that shield for herself. This makes Zeri a great pick for lanes with enchanter supports, as she can benefit from her own support shields and steal that of the enemies. Zeri's Q is where her kit really starts to get interesting. Her auto attacks are treated like abilities, in that they scale with AP and deal magic damage. She also has an additional mechanic called the Spark Pack, where after charging, through moving and casting her the active component of her Q, her next attack deals bonus magic damage and slows enemies. Now the active component of her Q, Burst Fire, is essentially like her auto attack. It deals physical damage and scales with AD and can apply on hit effects to the first enemy hit. It also has the same cooldown as her attack timer. So essentially, normally auto attack on any other champion, you'd be casting a Q on Zeri. Good luck wrapping your head around that one. Zeri's W is Ultra Shock Laser, which fires a beam that slows and damages the first enemy hit. If shot into a wall, it shoots out from the point of impact and essentially becomes a mini lock salt. This would be great to get some cheeky wall bangs on unsuspecting enemies who think they're safe basing over the wall. Zeri's E is Spark Surge, which causes her to dash a short distance and empowers her next three casts of Burst Fire, causing them to pierce through enemies. It also enables her to do a talent jump on steroids, which means she can essentially vault over any piece of terrain in the game if the angle is right. Zeri's ult is Lightning Crash, which releases a nova of electricity and grants her bonus attack damage, attack speed, and movement speed. Attacking an enemy champion refreshes the duration of these bonuses and grants her bonus movement speed. Also during this time, Burst Fire concentrates into three short rounds and chains lightning between enemies. This is a great tool that enables Zeri to get into the middle of a team fight and really wreak some havoc. Overall, Zeri seems like a very explosive champion that can be good in a wide range of scenarios. Her ability to deal hybrid damage makes her a bit more effective against those champions that just want to stack armor and make her irrelevant. Her short range is a bit of a drawback and her Q being split into numerous attacks can lead to some interesting interactions with certain champions. No slowing down. Overall though, Zeri seems extremely fun and can get into the middle of a team fight, dash around, do heaps of damage and get out with the use of her E. I think it'll be very fun to see how this champion performs not only in solo queue but also in competitive as it can be paired with both melee and range supports. Anyway guys, thank you all for watching and we'll see you next time.